Welcome back to Like a Dragon Ishin. If you're watching later on YouTube, thanks for clicking. Hope you've been enjoying this one so far. Alright. We're good. New chapter. Uh, where am I? I'm at, am I at headquarters? I'm at headquarters. Okay, that would explain it. So, since a new chapter's been done, there's probably going to be a bunch of new side quests. Um, there was word of a dude using a cannon. Let's begin with fishing. <laughs> River Classic. Alright, now we're talking. <laughs> Ugh. I don't move it close enough. <laughs> Fishing stream. <laughs> Got it. It's so I can do more cooking. Ultimately. Same fish. Bigger carp, though. I want to make the grilled fish again, because the last time I tried to make it, I messed it up. I need a lot of it. Some of the recipes require quite a bit of fish. Oh, did I get that? Yep. Hey, different fish. Crucian cop. My skills are sharp. <laughs> Animal Crossing. I can't believe I remember that.
た<笑>よし Ooh, I accidentally threw it back. Unfortunately, I can't reel it in. It's like pretty simplistic. Double tapped it. Come back. I need more Christian cop. There we go. Take the bait. It didn't take the bait. Hang on. We do have bait. Whoa. Hmm. That's gotta be like a record, yeah. I want to put that in a fish tank. It's probably very rare. Always becomes fishing at some point. Yeah. That's spot on.
Whoa. Ghost Koi. I'm kind of getting into seeing the different fish available. Oh, we got another one. Damn, the little ones. Go on the same spot again. That one took a while. Oh. Yeah. Salmon. <laughs> that was worth 2,000. Going straight back in. Ah, oh, the the effect's gone. Damn. Oh well. Wait, I have reputation. I'll do for now. Decent. What am I going to do? Looks like it's finally time to pack it in. That fisherman seems kind of down. What am I going to do? You okay? You seem kind of blue. Oh, yes. It's just I have to bring a fish back home with me today, or else I'll have to give up my passion for good. You mean you'll have to quit? I love fishing, probably more than most. The only trouble is I'm terrible at it. I haven't caught a single fish since the day I first cast out. Wait, not even one? Not a one. What's worse, my wife just loathes how it swallows up all my time and effort. I work my tail off and can't even bring home a decent meal. She finally decided enough is enough, so I made a promise that if I don't show up with a fresh catch after today, I'd never fish again. That's rough. Even today, I got nothing. Not even a twitch of the old rod. At this rate, my fishing days are sunk. Hey, here's a thought. This may sound strange, but do you fish? Uh, yeah. Now and then. I beg you, can I have some of your fish? Smallest you've got, even. You want my fish? Well, I can't ask anyone else, please. You'd be doing me a huge favor. I guess I can help him out. All right. If I find myself with an extra, I'll give him to you. Really? Ah, oh, thank you. You're a lifesaver. I'll certainly try to catch some fish on my own, of course. Still, please let me know if you've got any to spare. Okay. Today's the day. How's it going? They biting? Nope. Not today. Um. Krish well, we got a lot of carp, so let's just give him a carp. Brought you some fish. Whoa. Get a load of this one. Okay, this has got to be the last time. She's bound to believe in me now. You really saved me, and by the skin of my teeth, no less. No problem. Don't be so modest. I'm hanging on by a thread. Regardless, thank you so much. Desperate fisherman. 
a free worm. Wait, we can do sea fishing? Uh, hold on. Cancel. If I'm gonna do that, I should buy a bait first. Hey, you heard about the black ships, right? Yeah. The big ones that came from overseas. Apparently, the crew is demanding we open up the country. That's right. It's all true, you know? My pops lives close to the port where they arrived. Saw him with his own two eyes. Things were so enormous, they nearly blotted out the horizon. Yeah, and don't they have big cannons too? Who wouldn't be shocked knowing those things could kill your whole town? Guess my pops and all his neighbors should consider themselves lucky, yeah? Okay. Oh, come on, man. I just want to go home to the farm. Uh. What? <laughs> oh, glitch passive. You so silly. It, it got frozen because they couldn't run to me, so the battle just did not start, and then I guess it just corrected itself. I mean, okay, it's not how you pronounce it, but this dude's called Ouchie. Have an ouchie. Okay, I got an ouchie. Damn, I keep missing the punch. Damn, I'll spamming X like a madman. There we go. There we go. Back to the farm. Doggo! Um, is it hungry? Backflip. <laughs> I'm ready to give out more cucumbers. Use. 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 
Oh, that's everything. Uh, what can I buy? I got the Skekar, right? just utility. Yes, I'll buy the eggplant. I think I'm like close to the end of this. Okay. Hey, Nick, how's it going? Uh, doing alright, just kicking back. You got some extra on this month and order the Steam Deck. Oh, cool. Yeah, enjoy. I've heard those things are pretty neat. They're still not selling them in Australia. Alright. Ah, oh, The one standing on the next to the door always gets me. Anything new I can make? Hot pot. I think the ones with the ticks are the ones that I, I can make. Eh, not quite. I need sea bream. Can almost make udon. Alright, but we need to make a homemade dish, so let's just do this. Sakui. Yeah, I've just been messing around with um, 1440p with the PS5. Just seeing if it's like viable to use it on Twitch, or at the very least for the local recording. Okay. Alright, I gotta make another one. I'll just keep cooking the same one because I got a lot of daikon. Again, I, I broke the cutting board. It's a meme. One more. 
I'll make soup this time. But that's fine. <laughs> Nearly. <laughs> Can I break the cutting board? <laughs> it's either flimsy cutting boards or I just don't have my own strength. Ten produce for they're getting ten daikon. Carrot. I need 10, not mine. Alright. Just going to enable my mini game. of money. Alright. Do I need a heal? No, I'm fine. Ginseng is ten thousand. Oh, I think they temporarily disabled the taxi so I don't miss out on the main quest I had to do before. That makes sense. Now it's back. Ah, you again, boy. Feel free. Oh, fill up for more chopping, guess. Clean what you already done. 300 pieces. Alright, do it. Let's chop. Shit, 
too early. Damn it. <laughs> That's probably the longest combo I've had. Alright. Like, they really have the foundations for a farming sim. With all these minigames. Definitely a new record there. They take everything, all the mini games. They could easily make a farming sim. <laughs> if you think about it. There's a game for love, there's a game for chopping wood, there's a game for fishing. You got your crop cultivation. There's cooking. could easily make like a farming sim out of this game. You're getting there. Okay. Including what you've done. Oh no, yeah, we're gonna have to do it again. You can only do a hundred at a time. This is worth doing. Come on, man. <laughs> it seems like 15 is just where uh, it becomes very difficult. I can reliably get to 15. Ah. 
Ah. Better. Ah, oh, that was bad. I swung too early. I can't believe that it like it. I don't know why. I, I want this done. if anyone can get through the 100 without messing up. But like how insanely fast it would get. It probably has a cap. one. Well, of the hundred. One more hundred to do. <laughs> hey, you done it! Hmm? Done what? By my count, you chopped me over 300 pieces, like I asked you to. Here, let me get you your share. Nani. Wow, 300 pieces of wood already? See that? When you're really focused on your chopping, anything's possible. Thanks, boy. And you know what? My back's feeling mighty better right about now. So here, to commemorate the occasion. Broken compass. Hmm? Thank you very much. Pleasure doing business with you. Now, if you don't mind, I've got firewood to sell. See you later, boy. Yeah. Okay, so there's like one more segment to do with him. Um. Oh, yeah, the American... Oh, we want to go. Hold on. There. I think, yeah, almost maximum rank with the palanquin as well. Sorry, mister. You alright? Hmm. Mm. I'm okay. Uh, I gotta go. Excuse me. Hmm. In a rush to meet a girl, huh? Mm. Miho-chan. Shinta-kun. I read your letter. Please. It's not true, is it? I'm sorry. Hmm, what's going on? Uh. Oh crap, please, just listen. I accidentally uh -huh. skipped one. No! I don't want to hear it. Shintokun. I'm moving. My family and I are going away to Ido. Why, Miho-chan? Why are you doing this? It's my papa. He says we have to go there so he can work. When? Do you leave? Soon. Everybody's getting ready now. Why did you wait so long to tell me? I, I just couldn't. I'm sorry. 
I don't want you to be sorry. I want you to stay. Don't, don't be stupid. There's nothing I can do. Fine then. Just go. I never want to see your face again anyway. Leave me alone. <laughs> Shintokun. Don't go. Did you say your goodbye to your friend, Miho? Papa. It's almost time to leave. The palanquin will be here to pick us up soon. Make sure you have everything packed. Okay. <laughs> hey, are you gonna be alright? Hi. <laughs> I don't wanna end it like this. I don't want that to be how we said goodbye. I want to apologize, but I can't anymore. Thank you, mister. You were worried about me, right? Yeah. <laughs> I'm Miho. You're nice, mister. Sorry, I have to go now. Um, if it's okay with you, could I ask you a favor? Mm hmm, what is it? If you run into the boy I was talking to, Shintokun, could you tell him something? Thank you. Is that all? Yes, I'm sorry. I'll understand if that's too much to ask. <laughs> Goodbye. Take care, mister. I think I can manage that. Miho. That boy... Shinta. He ran off toward the temple. Okay. I mean... While we're here. No, no, no! Crap. Now I'm even getting mugged in the city. Okay, they're being annoying. Stupid pole arms. Alright, there we go. Okay, there he is. Hmm. That's the boy I saw arguing with his friend Miho earlier, Shinta. She asked me to deliver a message to him. Miho-chan, why'd you have to go? Why? Ugh, why'd I have to yell at you like that? Hey. Huh? Do you need something, mister? Actually, I have a message for you from Miho. Miho-chan? What did she say? Thank you. Huh? That's it? That's all she told me. But why would she be thanking me? Should we just fought? I haven't... I haven't done anything worth being thanked for. I don't understand. Were you and Miho close to one another? Mm. Yeah. Our houses are right by each other. Normally boys and girls... Oh wait, normally boys and girls your age have a hard time becoming friends. Yeah, maybe. There aren't many girls in our neighborhood, though, and Miho-chan didn't really have anybody else to get close to. I remember she'd always look so lonely, so one day I asked her if she wanted to play with me. I see. For a while, Miho-chan wouldn't even say anything back to me. But I just kept talking, and day after day, until she started talking too. And then we were friends. 
<laughs> Good going. Miho-chan is really fun to talk to. We laugh together every day. She's stubborn sometimes, but she's also really kind too. Sometimes the other boys would make fun of me for spending my time with her, but I never cared. Miho-chan is my best friend. But she's moving away and she didn't even tell me until now. Maybe I was dumb for thinking she cared about me. Maybe she never wanted to be my friend in the first place. Do you really believe that? Huh? I think I know why Miho wanted to give you that message, and I think you do too. What she meant when she said thank you. What Miho-chan meant? Thank you for caring about her. Don't you think she must realize how thoughtful you've been? Thoughtful? You were more concerned for her, for her feelings than you were for how others saw you. You stuck it out and really got to know her. I think Miho is grateful for that, don't you? Huh? So that's how she feels? Shinta seems to understand. I think I was able to communicate Miho's message clearly. That's why she probably couldn't tell you about the move until today. Try to see it from her point of view. Why would she keep something like that from you? Why'd Miho-chan wait to tell me? Maybe she couldn't tell you because that's how important you are to her. Huh? She knew you only had so much time left together. Maybe she didn't want anything to ruin that. Miho wanted to keep laughing with you until the very end. Oh. And that's why she waited so long? That's what I think. So then, are you okay with how you said goodbye to each other? No, I'm not. Mister, I have to see Miho-chan one more time. I have to tell her I'm sorry and... And I'm going to smile and tell her ha be happy. That's how I want to say goodbye. Good luck. Thank you, mister. Miho's house was in Karamachi. I wonder... I could see how it goes for them. Yeah, I wonder how that's gonna turn out. Alright. Oh, come on! Ah, no fighting! Cutscene! Oh, thank you. Come on, Miho. It's time to go. Just... just a little longer, Papa. You said you goodbye to your friend already, didn't you? The palanquin carriers have a schedule to keep. It's rude to make them wait. Okay. Shinta isn't here. Hey, stop! Don't leave yet! Miho Down it, please! Ah, ow, ow! I didn't make it! I'll never get to say goodbye. Ah. Shinta. Mister? <laughs> I was late. I think my ankle sprained. I can't run anymore. Don't worry. I'll stop the palanquin. <laughs> Miss, Mister, thank you. Chase scene. I'm too lazy to put the Mario 64 music. <laughs> excuse me, excuse me, out of the way. Hey, stop that palanquin. Mister, is that you? Miho, there's someone who still needs to talk to you. Huh? Mi Miho, Chan. Shintokun. You came back. Yeah. Uh, uh, um. Miho, Chan, I'm sorry. Huh? It must have been so hard for you to tell me you were going away. I was being selfish, and I never should have run off like that. I'm sorry for what I said to you. Shintokan. No, I'm sorry. I knew I had to tell you we were moving, but I couldn't. I felt like once I said it, I'd never see you again. 
Miho chan. Please don't cry. I decided I would say goodbye with a smile. You know, I cry real easy. I want to. I want to grow up and be strong so you never have to worry about me. Shintokun. Hey, Miho, we have to get going. Oh, okay. I'm sorry, Shintokun. I can't make them wait anymore. It's okay. I'm so happy you came to see me one more time. I promise I'll write you letters. Me too. I'll write you letters all the time for the rest of my life until I am an old man. Okay then, so will I. Thank you. Mister, I'd like you to have this. Shintokun, goodbye. Goodbye. Miho-chan. Hmm? Thank you, too. Hmm. Well done. Ugh. Ugh. Ah. <laughs> okay. This is what I came here for. Sugi san, he's so late. That's the woman that that strange samurai Aguri is after. Her name is Suzu, isn't it? Hmm. Finally, Kasugi, how dare you make purest hearts your puerile? Uh, pu oh my god, <laughs> I hate reading this guy. Plaything. Suzu chan, I weep to spy you waiting for this scoundrel. Couldn't help yourself, huh? Hey. Sir uh, Saito. <laughs> I see. Mm hmm. Someone's coming. Suzu chan. Mm -hmm. Oh, Ikasugi san. There you are. <laughs> <laughs> you are waiting here long. Sorry, but you know it takes time to look this good, don't ya? <laughs> <laughs> it's all right. You've got a weakness for pretty things, Ikasugi san. So that's him. Aye. He's handsome. Seems like the kind of guy who's popular with women. Ah, <sighs> so you agree Suzu san must too be victim of his bewitching veneer? Calm down. Just see how things go. Anyway, I got something really important to talk to you about, okay? Yes, what is it? Suzu chan, I want to marry you. Huh? Damn. He doesn't mince words. Hey, are you alright? <laughs> Harry? Marry me, but we don't even know each other that well. Why me? Ah, because of that face of yours. You're so beautiful. Woman. I just want to look at your face, like, all the time. Oh. What? What's up? Why aren't you accepting my proposal? Don't I have a perfect face, too? We're like soulmates, but base mates. Farewell, odious world. Only through seppuku shall... Seppuku shall I purge myself of this misbegotten form. Stop it. Uh, I'm sorry. Eh? Yeah. <laughs> For what? I just... I care about who people are on the inside, not what they look on the outside. I appreciate the thoughts, but no. <laughs> hey! To what strange illusion have I succumbed believing as my eyes would have it that Suzu's son would reject Ikasugi? This is a good thing. In fact, it could be a chance to tell her how you feel. Eh? How I... 
Yeah. You love her, don't you? You speak folly. Why do you say that? Look upon me, Sir Saito. My face has doomed me to a life of scorn and ridicule. For whose curse be more woeful than the hideous man's? What are you talking about? Suzu treats you normally, doesn't she? It's so, but the seeding courtesies of friendship rarely blossom into the flowers of <laughs> romance. <laughs> what I mean is, people can have ugly friends, but not ugly lovers. I can't risk ruining the relationship Suzu-san and I already have. She'd never feel comfortable around me again if I said the wrong thing. Huh. <sighs> Deep down, Aguri's just a man who's afraid of other people will hurt him. Maybe there's something I can say to encourage him. <laughs> Why not go out with me and say it? <laughs> Why don't you have... Why don't you have any faith in Suzu? Huh? Didn't you hear what she said before? She cares about what's on the inside. Don't you believe her? If you love her, you have to be willing to trust her, after all. Show Suzu the real you. Let her make up her own mind before you decide for yourself what she thinks. You're not a bad guy. Have some confidence in yourself and in Suzu. So, Saito. I have no claim to the honor of a samurai should I ignore your wise words. I shall go confess my love to her forthwith. Do you know where to find her? Suzu san favors a particular spot in times of trouble and distress. The shrine near the barracks of the Shinsengumi. <laughs> you sure know her well. <laughs> Off I go with faith invigorated in Suzu and myself. Farewell, Sir Saito. I really don't want to read this dude's text again. It gives me a headache. <laughs> Good luck, Aguri. Hmm? Is Ikasugi still over there? N never been so. <laughs> I've never been so pissed off. Huh? I offered her a dream life. Imagine getting to look at me every day. What's so great about people's insides? It's just a bunch of chewed up food. Oh, I'll show her what's on the inside, all right? He seems liable to do something dangerous. I wonder if I should check on Suzu and Aguri. All right, we'll go there later. I don't know how many more meals I have to share with this guy. Probably like three. <laughs> My lucky man with a bento that you've cared about his loving wife. Looks like he's still here. Should I share my food with him? Okay. Um, yeah. I have more today. Do you want some? Yes, yes, of course. Thank you once again. I've really come to treasure these. Your wife's homemade bento. What's in today's? I just can't bring myself to break it to him. Please, the noises. <laughs> Amazing every time. It tastes of thoughtfulness. Every speck of seasoning brims with care for one's beloved. I guess. There's not a doubt in his mind this was made by some wife he dreamed up. <laughs> Excuse me, there's something I'd like to ask you. Do you think it's possible for me to meet her? What? I know, it's a foolish request asking a man to introduce you to his wife. But then, when I eat her cooking with every bite, I'm simply overcome with these feelings of love. You shouldn't talk like that. You have a wife of your own, you know. Oh, don't get me wrong. I'm not in love with your wife. I'm in love with her cooking. Please, even just a glimpse. Won't you let me meet the person who made this incredible food? What the hell do I do? It's backing me into a corner here. Let me think about it, okay? Of course. I know it's a lot to ask, but don't you understand what it means to me? I never told him I have a wife. But I still feel like I've been lying to him somehow. 
I'll let you know, alright? I'll be back with another bento at least, so we'll talk then. Thank you so much. <laughs> yeah. We're either going to tell them the truth or someone's going to pose. What's going on over here? Okay. Well, it's not a side quest. I was expecting, <laughs> no, like a scam artist. There's always something going on. Ah, it's you. The scent. You've brought me what you've promised. Does my food really smell that strongly? No, I'm merely a genius. Now please, may I taste it? Um, have the soup. Hope you like it. Bon appetit. Brilliant! This is extraordinary! Oh, I feel a mysterious heat igniting my very soul. The ingredients? Possibly. The seasoning? Perhaps. Yet altogether, these radical tastes rally themselves along the rivulets of my palates. Just a touch more. Ah. Your cooking is wonderful. Though you appear average in every other way, no ordinary man could craft a dish like this. You once again brought me to the brink of true revelation. I feel as though I'm mere mouthfuls from putting it all together. I see. Well, sorry it wasn't enough. Don't apologize. Bring me another course. I'm certain your food can change history. Hmm. I guess after all that, one more can't hurt. It seems like it's the same text, but I'll, I already have another meal, so let's just do it again. <laughs> oh, he said something slightly different. All right, well... Brilliance, sheer brilliance. So, does it finally do it for you? Be quiet. It's almost there. If I just reach my tongue to the right and... Ah. I believe I have something. Really? Yes. Thanks to your homemade meals, I'll redefine Japanese cuisine itself. Thank you. Well, that's good. Yes. I must go. I have to prepare. I have to create. Meet me here again, and I will upend everything you know of food. Alright, I'll come back. Okay. Well, I guess if I have to kill time. Hey, Sandy. <laughs> Guess if I have to kill time. また来てくれたんですね。嬉しい。元気にされてました。かなり調子がいいな。そうですか。なら今日もいっぱい楽しみますね。あ、そうだな。お酒でも飲みましょう。お客さん、今日はどれくらい飲まれます? <laughs> Alright. 
I'm ready. This is probably not the first thing you want to see in the morning, admittedly, what's coming up. プレッシャーさんよし。<笑> Alright, Alright. <laughs> that ability. <laughs> it's an ability I have. Okay, pressure's on! Oh, my thumb's gonna hurt. Rest. Yeah, be honest. Like, waking up, this is probably not uh, the thing you would expect to see right away. Probably not w awake enough for this shit. Oh shit. 
Okay, okay. Okay, I'm ready. Definitely not something to expect to see on your way to a church job. What do you mean? This is perfectly holy. <laughs> Let's see if you can get the job done. Oh my god. If you, I might give you a special treat. Oh, no. Oh my god, this is so difficult. Why is it standing still? Come on! This is the furthest I've been. Jeez. I think I got it. Yes! <laughs> See a very holy image right there. That was harder than um I thought it was going to be. I mean the mini game not never mind. <laughs> Those speech bubbles took took a lot to take out. All right, uh, the dude should be back, hopefully. Oh, here you are. It's you, you're back. So you were able to come up with something. Yes, here. Yeah. What did you come up with? What is this? I call them revolutionary croquettes. I wanted you to be the first to taste them, considering all you've helped. All right. I'll be glad to. Brilliant. I've never tasted anything like this. The flavors aren't Japanese, but somehow they're still nostalgic. I'm pleased you enjoy it. To think something this delicious could have been inspired by the simple meals I brought you. Your cooking was instrumental to me. I'll be forever grateful. If you like, I can teach you the recipe. I'd be honored for you to try it making yourself. Oh. Neat. You've made me to change this country with my food. Thank you so much. Hmm. Good luck. And to you. Okay. Oh, hello there, playboy. I must say, I have a desperate need for your special vegetables again. Won't you give me some? I'll take whatever you can spare. My, so alluring. Thank you so much.
Enjoy that cucumber. Excuse me. I'm going back to the farm. Wait, what is this? Apparently the dance school here has a pretty famous teacher. Oh yeah, we know this already. Wait, is that? Stop fooling around. Where is Saito? How should I know? You all are the ones crushing on him so bad. I don't buy it. I've seen how friendly you are with him. I'm a friendly guy. People always tell me I have excellent social skills. What's going on here? Ah, Saito-san. Boy, am I glad to see you. He finally makes his appearance. You're one of the Black Panther couriers, right? One of? Hardly. I'm the Black Panther courier's leading man, Makino, and I'll be the one that defeats you today. You do realize I wouldn't even deliver any more letters if you didn't keep forcing me to race. You could just leave me alone. It's not happening. Not after you beat Hoshi, sloppy as it was. A win's a win, and we can't let a win go unanswered. <sighs> this is ridiculous. Makino, the leading man, he's famous for his panache. Like when he dances after making a successful delivery. But he's got skills to back it up. His endurance allows him to deliver, and deliver without ever stopping. <laughs> this one's got an eye for talent. Hmm. Let's keep it nice and simple. First to deliver 12 letters wins. Fine by me. Then let's go, Korea Samurai. I probably shouldn't follow him. Like, his path is usually shit. Okay, he's following me. That's bad news. I got this. Dude's so far behind. Hey! Take the letter! Take the fucking letter! There you go. Okay, I'm going down the street first. Oh shit, that's not gonna work. Go back. Got it. Just. <laughs> I messed up a little bit. <laughs> I, I win. <laughs> ha! Don't believe my eyes. Two in a row against the Panthers? Damn it all. 
I made wrong wrong turn. That's it. If not for that, I'd... Grace me again. Just one more time. You're embarrassing yourself, Makino. Recovering from wrong turns is as important a skill as any. If you can't do that, you sully the Black Panther's courier's name. <laughs> Damn it. Saito, yes? Yeah. It looks like I'll have to face you myself. You were lucky to defeat Makino. But that's as far as you'll go. I'm the Black Panther's courier playmaker. Because no one can overcome my strategic ability. My deliveries know no errors. Your luck's run out, I'm afraid. It wouldn't be so sporting to compete with you now after you just raced. Rest well. Your days of victory are at an end. See you soon. Inamoto will be next, huh? Judging by his confidence, this might not be easy. Ah, Saito-san. Hmm, yeah? Kiyokawa? Hey, uh, I've been just wondering uh, about our relationship. We are friends, right? I mean, it's hard to tell with you and uh, I, I don't want to assume anything, but... Ugh. Uh, I guess we go home one more time and cook the meal. And I guess we go do uh, Team America, the quest. Stop it! You know what this, this fighting style reminds me of is just the way Majima played in Yakuza 0, just absurdity <laughs> with the breakdancing, except it's like a spinning sword and a spinning gun attack. Ah, I never thought I'd lose the fight. Uh-huh. That strength of yours is the real deal. Why don't you let me contribute to making you unstoppable? I'll join up with you. Sure. Looking forward to working with you. Oh, no need to thank me. I understand why you'd want me on your team. That's the first time that's happened. I think I'm getting a reputation, finally. Oh, right. Hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on. We need a... Hmm? What's all the commotion? It's here. A black ship. What? What is that haircut? It's got a cannon and everything. That has to be it. It's one of the black ships. We're all gonna die. Yeah, are you serious? Knock, knock. Time to open the country. All right. What's he want with us? Oi. Hey. You're not here to cause trouble, are ya? <laughs> oh. mm? Huh? What's wrong? 
Someone help! Sick, sick, very. He's seasick? I sure hope this isn't an act, but I suppose I could find a way to fix him up just in case. Now, what could I help him out here? Maybe these onlookers have an idea. I don't know. Well? Oh. Hey, you know any cures for seasickness? This foreigner's in pretty bad shape. Um, let me think. Actually, my ma once said to drink sake. You'll still be dizzy as heck, but at least you won't be hurting. Ah, oh, I get it. You fold in the nausea of seasickness with the nausea of being drunk. Not bad. Seems legit. Oh, severe headache, visions, fading, all going dark. I, I believe I have sake. Yeah, have some sake. What? Sake? Yeah, if you want to hide a tree, put it in a forest. If you want to hide seasickness, get drunk. It's the Japanese way. Wow, very deep. Japan, very deep. Well, how's the sake treating you? Oh, entire world spinning round and round it goes. Oh, uh, does that mean you liked it? <laughs> Danger! Robert Duke Imminent! Well, that sure didn't work. Can't say I'm surprised. I'm fresh out of ideas, so maybe I should ask someone else. We're going to kill this man before this quest is over. Ask someone else? Who, who am I gonna ask? Oh, over there, okay. <laughs> Excuse me. Ah, oh, damn it. Damn it! <laughs> Leave me alone. I thought this was the quest, it's not. Alright. I'm not sure what else to give him. If getting drunk to solve seasickness doesn't work, what should I give him? Now I have to solve his drunkenness and the seasickness. I'm gonna wait in this line again. Did you find, uh, the drunk voice amusing, Messiah? You should have heard when I won the, uh... I don't even know what to call it. <laughs> what, what, do, what do you call the minigame where it's implied that you, uh, you have sex? Thank you very much. Next in line, please.
Thank you very much. Next in line, please. Can't believe this many people are waiting for Inari. I'm dying to taste it. Almost there. Oh, almost there. Soon it'll be my turn. Thank you very much. Next in. Oh. Hmm. Very sorry. We sold our last sackful for the day. What? Again? It's really all gone? I'm afraid so. I hope you won't be too discouraged to try again. And after I made it all the way to the front. Nothing else to do but try again, I guess. That Inari must be amazing. Why do I get the feeling it's, like, going to be drugs or something? Um, the exclamation point is still there. Alright, what do I give a, a person who is now seasick and drunk? Fuck off! <laughs> Why are they always there? Right. Ah, uh, uh, vision fading. Oh, god, dark. <laughs> I can always come back later. I okay. What if we make like some food? Maybe some home cooking. Maybe some soup? I'm just gonna do it this way. Strawberries? What now? Saito-san! Hello there, I have a letter addressed to you! Uh, thanks, huh? Hmm? I thought you were a courier. Who are you? My apologies, I'm Hirakawa, chief of the Black Panther couriers. Oh no. The chief? Yes. I believe you're acquainted with my team, having already dispatched Hoshi and Makino. I didn't dispatch anyone, they issued a challenge and I accepted, that's all. I see. Forgive me, I'm simply surprised that my couriers could lose to an amateur. Until now, we were known as the fastest in Kyo. You've brought no small amount of shame to our reputation. Not that it's my concern, but weren't you trying to ruin your competitor's reputation? Seems like you reap what you sow. Haha, <laughs> you're a saucy one, Saito-san. I suppose you've a point. So why are you here? This doesn't feel like a neighborly visit. Yes, well, allow me to be blunt. I would like you to join my team. You want me on the Panthers? Just so. As I said, our reputation has been damaged. Rumor abounds of Kyo's new speedy delivery men, swifter even than the Black Panther couriers. There are two ways of undoing this. Outrace you, or make you one of us. Either way, we remain the fastest in Kyo. Right. If you recruit the upstart amateur, this is one more win for the Panthers. Ho oh, ho, precisely so. We provide a most generous salary. You would find it quite lavish, judging by the state of your abode. Sorry, but no. I never wanted to be a courier, and I can't say your way of doing business has changed my mind. Hmm. <laughs> the Panthers are fast. But there's more to deliveries than that. Senders and recipients want their letters handled with care. Speed's not about... Speed's not a bad quality, but heart matters just as much. I think as long as you treat deliveries like a race, that will escape you. <laughs> I just think of, um... All, all the times people share about, like... Um... Deliveries and how they fuck them up. It just takes me back to the, uh, there's this famous one that happened here in Australia where, um, you know, when, when they miss your delivery, they leave you a little card 
that tells you, oh, you know, we you weren't home, so uh, just come and pick it up at this address. So this person got home, had one of those cards in their mailbox, and there wasn't instructions on how to pick up the package. It was just an apology note that said, sorry, accidentally put your parcel on the roof of your house. Accidentally put your parcel on the roof of your house. The word accidentally. I see. Well, the Panther Couriers appreciate your valuable feedback. Nonetheless, you leave me with no choice but to crush you underfoot for the sake of my business. Delivery for you. A letter. What is this? You'll understand once you read it. Farewell, Saito-san. Better take a look. This is Inamoto, the Black Panther's career's playmaker. If your feet are rested and prepared, let's have our match. I'll await you at the bridge near the gambling den in Rakugai. Once and for all, we'll see who the fastest is in Kyo. So a formal invitation. The bridge in Rakugai. Huh? Might as well see this through. Do I have to? What a megalomaniac. Alright. I need to make a... Uh, I'll make two just in case. Sakoi. Oh, you know what this reminds me? <laughs> you know how I keep breaking the cutting board in this game? I actually broke my cutting board in real life. I forgot- I forgot to say. <laughs> it's- it's- I mean, it's, it's not completely broken, but it, it's kind of bent. And I- I laughed a little too much at it. Because it was just like... You know. I'm slowly becoming this character. I need a new cutting board now. Oh, hello, cat. What do you want, cat? Do you get some attention? I think that's hunger. I can't remember. Alright. Got it right. This just makes me want to play starter. <laughs> <laughs> they have the makings of a great farming simulator here. Okay. Let's see if food helps the drunk man. Hang on. Is there anyone else that wants to chime in on advice? Oh, hello. Hey, do you know how to cure seasickness? I want to help out that foreigner. Cure seasickness, hmm. I don't know much about it, but I heard it's good ex to exercise. Exercise? Really? Yeah, like, sweat the toxins out. Hey, you're a samurai, maybe you do a training session with him. That'll work up a sweat. Hmm. I don't know about sweating out toxins, but giving him something else to focus on might not be a bad idea. Oh, we're gonna- we're going to kill this dude before this day is over. Oh, Headache, vision fading, all going dark. Alright, time for some training. What? Tra- Training? 
Yes. Your heart is in chaos, but if you renew your focus, the sickness will depart. Discipline yourself with the sword. It's the Japanese way. Uh, start nishing, you samurai are. <laughs> we gonna bait the crap out of him? Get ready. Oh my god. Is he just gonna go down in one hit? Okay, no, no, he, he's got... I mean, we're still beating the crap out of him, but... <laughs> I'm just gonna hit him and just a bunch of vomit is gonna come out. Oh, oh, okay. Dude's American, you can hear the accent. You know what I hear is great? For a stomach ache? Oh wait, I can't do it. Never mind. Don't worry about it. We'll just uh, hit him with the sword. Finish! Ugh. <sighs> well? You feel better? <gasps> Oh, oh, no, no, I'm ten times worse. Entire world spinning around, and round it goes. <sighs> yeah, that was a wasted effort. Can't say I'm surprised. I need to figure out a cure for him. Maybe I should ask someone else. Watch out, here I come. I think it's a case of I just need to leave the area and come back, because she was not there before. Uh, hold on, there might be a building I... Oh. Let me try line up again. Line simulator. All right, one more, onto the line. Onto the line. Thank you very much. Next in line, please. Thank you very much. Next in line, please. Please don't sell out again. Ugh, almost there. Finally, I'll be able to try this Inari. Ten sackfuls of Inari for you, sir. Hooray! My turn. Next in line, what can I get you? Inari, please. Right away. Oh. Would you look at that? Seems there's only one sackful left, and it's yours. Hmm. I'm glad I waited. Here you go. Enjoy. I'm sorry, we're all sold out for the day. Apologies. No, oh, it can't be. What is this going to be? I was finally able to buy a sackful of this Inari for myself. All right. I should find somewhere I can sit and savor it. Hmm? What the hell is that about? The Inari. <laughs> it's gone! That bastard! Wait. <laughs> Hands off my sushi. Sack. That is quite the sentence. <laughs> A sack of suit. That doesn't even sound appealing. Alright.
get back! Yeah. Oh, I couldn't help myself. <laughs> it's just a running gag with these games. Ugh. Give me back my sack, now. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm real sorry. What happened? You're so desperate to try it for yourself that you resorted to theft? It's not that, I, I swear, I, I had a reason for what I did. What reason? It's my son, he's sick, too sick to even leave his bed, he has no more appetite. He hasn't eaten anything in days. But this morning, he looked me in the eye and said that he wanted Inari. He's only ever had it once before, but I still... I guess he never forgot the taste. I ran as fast as I could to queue up for one, but it sold out right as I got to the head of the line. Hmm. So, that's why you tried to grab mine? I'm sorry. I know it was wrong. If you want to hand me over to the authorities, I won't resist. Here, take it. Eh? Huh? Your son is hungry, isn't he? Don't keep him waiting. But, sir! There's a sick child out there, hoping his father will come home with Inari for him. Are you sure? You must have wanted it badly for yourself. That's true, but in this case, I don't mind lining up one more time. Don't worry. It's all right. <laughs> I don't know how to thank you. This is the last chance my son had to ever taste Sidari. Hmm? What do you mean? Haven't you heard? The vendor's moving on tomorrow. The whole Inari shop headed to some city. That's why it had to be today. Wait, what? This is the last of its kind. Truly precious, sir. Thank you again. Farewell. Y y yeah. I think I'll go eat a dungo or something. <laughs> well, I lost my sushi sack. Alright, is there anyone who can give me an advice on how to cure this man? Anyone? Anyone at all? Okay, otherwise I'll walk... Wait, oh, hold on. You. Hey! Hey, you know any all-time remedies for seasickness? I want to cure that foreigner. Seasickness, eh? Well, why not give that man an umeboshi? Umeboshi? Yeah, pop a plum in his mouth and he'll be right as rain. Just you wait. <laughs> Though, I can't quite remember where I heard that. <laughs> hmm. Okay, an umeboshi really cures seasickness. Maybe I should ask around for more opinions. Okay. Um... I think I need to find a specific vendor for that. Hang on. Unless there's no more opinions to be heard. Uh, I don't even know where to find this. We need a street food vendor. Oh, it's, yeah, that guy. Street food vendor, where are you? I think I might have to go up Crime Alley. I don't see one nearby. All right. Let's head up. I didn't want to, but I might have to. Ugh, 
Why? Why every time? Every, every, every time. Oh no, they've got big weapons now. If I do find one, I'm taking a taxi back. <laughs> Alright, sure. Where is the street food vendor? Oh no. Not that way. I ran into him once. Shady bar, hang on. Pickles, no, mystery meets to you. Hold on. Creepy bar. No. I might not have any luck. Oh my god, leave me alone! What other stores have we got? Oh, there we go, Sundry's Peddler. Damn it. Wait, a cyber... <laughs> um, why don't I give him a capsule that is literally cyber capsule? He didn't have it. Why am I wasting time? <laughs> I have a capsule that is describing the effect that I want. Damn it. I might have to just go to a grocer and buy it and then make it myself. Hold on. That's a bait manga. I want some bait. You want that. I'll buy another orange because I just want to fight with them. Yeah, what about Don Quixote? Please tell me you have it for sale. Rakugan. Persimmon, fig, egg, honey, ginkgo, out of season, umeboshi. There we go, got it. Okay. And there's a taxi just over here.
Okay. I want to see how this ends. Uh, oh, it's the same thing every time. Yeah, eat this. Oh, oh what is this? Umeboshi. They're sour pickled plums. Supposedly, they can cure seasickness. I'd say it's worth a try. Yes, please. Please, give, give me. Oh, it worked. I feel so much better. Thank you very much. Honestly, I wasn't sure those would help, but I'm glad they did. So, I'm forever grateful, but if you'll excuse me, I have errands to run. Uh. All right. Boy. Oh, right. I wanted to ask, why are you here? Hmm. Ah, yes, it's all coming back to me. I'm here to open up the country. Open up the country? Now I see, you wanted to establish trade with us. Yes, Japan has so many wonderful things, I'd like to have some myself. Yeah, and what is it you want? But first, let me introduce you to myself. You can call me... Monsieur Pony. Really? Uh, I should have introduced myself as well. My name is Saito. Excellent. Now that that's out of the way, uh, what were we talking about? I was asking you what you wanted from Japan. Oh, right, right, yes. I've been thinking about what I'd like to take home the most. And now I have discovered it. Okay. And what is it? Umeboshi. Umeboshi? That's it? Yes! I've never eaten anything so mysterious, yet packing... Pack it so conveniently. I want as much of it as I can get. Alright, then I'll show you where it is. Ha! Huh, this is wonderful! Thanks to you, I've got more umeboshi than I can count. <laughs> Hopefully you've got enough to last you the voyage home. <laughs> Who knows? I may just scarf them all down before I reach land. Huh. Hmm? Are you the one who's been secretly trading with foreigners? Foreigners are the enemy. We won't tolerate anyone who engage with them. The Sono Jui. Jo Ui. Of all the times to run into extremists. Son of Joey, you say? I have a friend named Joey, and why are they mad? Do they how do they want some Umeboshi? Japan's in a complicated place right now. You should stay back. We'll kill you and a foreigner. Who needs traitors anyway? I want to I want to see I want to see this hang on let's we'll see if I can do it Yes! <laughs> Time for juice! <laughs> so good.
Oh, look at you, Saito. Oh, never have I seen a samurai in action before. What a find. What a find. Sorry about them. You could say foreigners aren't very popular these days. We may be a good long way from truly opening up Japan. Think so. I think it'll all work out as long as folks like you are around. After all, it only takes a ripple to make a wave. That's true whether you're in Japan or my homeland. I hope you're right about that. At any rate, I'd like you to have this for your troubles. Ooh. That's used for, uh, for gun upgrades. Thanks for the umeboshi and opening up. At least on a personal level. Goodbye, Mr. Saito. Goodbye, pony. Don't get too seasick now. Foreigners sure can be strange. But it'd be nice if they... There came a day when we could talk to them without fear or hostility. Okay. This was uh, the last side quest I was going to do for now. I got to head off chat. It is Sunday. <laughs> But I do hope you enjoyed today's stream. I'll do more of this tomorrow and maybe something else. So we'll see how it goes. Um, and yeah, if you're watching later on YouTube, thanks for clicking, sticking around to the end, all that stuff. And uh, consider clicking more buttons for algorithm stuff to support the channel or watch more stuff. But yeah, thanks, YouTube. Bye, YouTube.